the spiritual path, the four seasons and the hours, winter. Winter is the last stage symbolically of the spiritual path. It takes its symbolism from the main activity that takes place during this stage, purification or whitening in some alchemical symbolism, which leaves you snow white. This stage goes from midnight and north to dawn on our diagram, east symbolically, and it is a gruelling stage. Leaving you a little grumpy. The symbolism and events that happen during day four and rebirth the dark night of the soul, the midnight hour, are treated in most symbol systems as a state in its own right and called purgatory. And we have captured this separation simply because it is rich in symbols and stories. Cinderella, beheading and fire are all involved. A separate video covers the subject. So this video covers contact, purification and relearning, which eventually involves redemption, and the final push to the states of Moksha and Nirvana on day 7. Contact If one successfully passes through rebirth, then contact with you is gradually made. Through dreams or even visions, you find your higher spirit. Symbolically, you, as the personality, may climb the red rope in prayers, or swim up the blue river and listen to your intuition to obtain that contact, or both. And if you are a princess, you get to meet your prince, who may arrive with the gifts of insight and wisdom. Or if you are the prince, you get to meet your princess, waiting patiently in her tower. Some princesses have had to wait so long before the prince catches on, they lie virtually comatose. And others are sometimes made almost permanently comatized by the poisoned apples of knowledge and ego they have fed. But the added contact connects or reconnects you with the spiritual world and provides you as a consequence with more help. And what may result is a symbolic baby. New projects, new ideas, new direction, new insights. And the more contact you have with the seven symbolic planets on your ascent, the bigger the baby grows. Hyros Gamos From this moment on, you and your higher spirit are lovers. The masculine and the feminine, the sun and the moon in your character, will be in balance, emotions tempered by reason and giving you wings to fly. This is then known as the chemical wedding, the mystical marriage, or Hieros Gamos. Purification There are three main activities during this stage of purification and relearning with symbolic water. Questioning, examining and doubting all your beliefs 
with the aim of ridding your memory of false memories and erroneous beliefs. Ridding or expunging your memory of demons, which are memories of hurt. Demons you have inflicted on others. Demons inflicted on you by others and demons that are self-inflicted. Continual suppression of the ego, the big I am, that gives you that impression of false self-esteem, an individual self, False self-confidence in your rightness and maybe everyone else's wrongness. In other words, a search for genuine humility. Meanwhile, your aim is to try to stay healthy because the rigours of this stage can be exhausting and continue the search to know yourself. How to Know Higher Worlds Rudolf Steiner We advance even more quickly if we fill our consciousness with admiration, respect and reverence for the world and life. Anyone experienced in these things knows that such moments awaken forces in us that otherwise remain dormant. Filling our consciousness in this way opens our spiritual eyes. We begin to see things around us that we could not see before. A basic mood of devotion to everything truly worthy of reverence suffuses our entire life. This one fundamental feeling becomes the centre of our soul's life. Mm -hmm.